day of the party. Melanie, someone say we found love in a hopeless place on TikTok. All jokes aside, after our first weekend together in the real hopeless place, New York City in the middle of a pandemic, I knew you were the one. God works in mysterious ways, and in this case, he blessed me with something I never imagined. A gorgeous, kind-hearted woman with a smile that could light up the darkest room. Melanie, you know, I remember when my brother first mentioned meeting you, I was left thinking, you went all the way to New York for a date? <clears throat> but he was awestruck by your own passion, your brilliance, and your determination. And that chance meeting has become this beautiful relationship. Ryan, I truly believe that everything in my life has led me to you. To this moment, standing in front of you, about to become your wife. I couldn't have asked for a more supportive, genuine, and loving partner. You give me the type of love people say is only in fairy tales. The kind of love that some don't believe is real. And how I'm lucky am I to have a love that people pray for. Hi. Hey. Hey, cool you so handsome. Oh my goodness. Are you excited? Very excited. Yeah. It's yeah. ready. You're it's ready. time. It's time. It's time. It is. I wish I could stand up here and promise you the world, but the world isn't mine to give. What I do promise is my world and all it entails. My love, support, passion, and empathy. Hi, love. Come here. You look so handsome. I promise to love you the way that you deserve to be loved. You are my person my love, my forever, and I can't wait to spend my time loving you. I love you very much. But of all the incredibly amazing things that Ryan has done in his life, I can confidently say the most impactful and amazing was to ask Melanie to be his wife. Mel, I just want to say that I'm so proud to be your friend, and I know you have some family members who are not here with you today, but I know Billy is always here with you, and I'm also so proud of you. Melanie and Ryan, thank you again for allowing me to share um, in your beautiful day and I hope you have many years of love and happiness. Even though I never got to introduce you to my brother, I know he has met you. And then he also had something to do with bringing you not only into my life, but Bobby's as well. I thank God, Billy, and your TikTok for you page for crossing our paths. Yeah. I promise to always honor Billy and make him proud of his brother-in-law by the way I treat his sister. Though we never officially met, he's always answered my prayers, and I know Grandma and him are happy to see us both in this moment. In you, I found a partner in life, a lover, a friend, a safe place, someone I could be my most vulnerable with. In you, I found someone who supports me, who inspires me, who respects me. In you, I found someone I want to have it all with. That biblical kind of love. I'm so happy and full of joy to see the love that Melanie and Ryan have for each other. My wife and I are also so grateful that we were able to witness our son fall in love and get married to this woman of his dreams. My hope for my son and his new bride are that they find the same comfort in each other that my wife and I find in each other every day. And always remember, bud, 
We are with you all. Buddy Shrimp. I wish I could promise to always be as handsome as I am today. But well, have you seen my dad? <laughs> On second thought, he's not too shabby. So maybe that's a promise I can also keep. Bobby, not only do I have promises to make to your mom, but I have promises I want to make to you. Over the last several years, you've taught me how to be a more patient, kind, and loving person. You've also taught me more random facts than anyone I know, which is something I'll always love about you and your continuous drive to learn. I promise to do my best to learn more about bugs, other outdoor creatures, and even how to play Roblox. Yet I promise to comfort you after your first sports loss, your first breakup, and even when you just need someone to listen and be there. I promise to do my best to be a positive example, leader, and the best bonus dad for you. Lastly, even though I wasn't the one to give you the gift of life, life gave me the gift of you. I love you, buddy, and I promise to love you for the rest of my life. Ryan, I always wanted a creature pal. And mom, I love you so much. Yeah, I'm dreaming. Therefore, by the power vested in me as a minister of the gospel and as a marriage officer in the Commonwealth of the Bahamas, I pronounce you on this 22nd day of October 2022. Husband and wife, you can now kiss your bride. We present for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Ryan Lowry as they walk off into the sunset. Congratulations. Not only do we get a great guy in the family, but we get his family, which is great too. And what more could you ask for? I just want to say congratulations to Ryan and Melanie. Melanie, you really impressed me with the first time you met me and Joan when you came in. And the first thing you did, you didn't even say hi to us. You hugged Scooter. All right. And that really impressed us. All right. We love you. Congratulations, Ryan and Melanie. DJ, hit it.